What's up, Capricorn? This is Evolving Wisdom, and you guys, I'm here, and I'm still evolving. All right, Capricorn, we're going to jump right into you guys' energy and see what's going on with you all, okay? Please like, share, and subscribe. Thank you all for the donations, okay? If you guys want to continue to donate, please check the information that's pinned at the bottom and also in the description box. The information will be there, okay? If you guys would like a personal reading or any information on my protection services or protection products that I offer, you guys can hit me up at EvolvingWisdom5.com. Check me out on my Instagram. And again, you guys, please like, share, and subscribe. That helps my channel out, okay? All right, let's see. What is going on? What is going on with my Capricorn? Capricorn. What is going on with my Capricorn? What do my Capricorns need to know? What does my Capricorns need to know? What does my Capricorns need to know? What does my Capricorns need to know? Okay. Interference. It's crazy because Capricorns, y'all energy could come reminds me of the Aquarius reading I kind of um, did. There's interference in, around you guys here with a lover, a past lover, somebody who's stalking you, either spiritually stalking you or physically stalking you. I feel both. I feel like they try to watch your social media, try to find you. All the above here. Um, a lot of mental blockages coming in here for my Capricorns. Okay, there are some legal issues that's coming in. I feel like someone's trying to stop this legal issue, these legal battle. I don't know if you guys are going through a divorce or just maybe um, child support type of issue. I just feel like someone is trying to stop this energy. Some of you guys are dealing with a joker type of male energy, very crafty. You, either this person is a. a financially stable here or this person likes to use women or men for their money here okay a lot of burdens and blockages still trying to come in for you all here okay some of you guys have a, a um have met someone or has a friend around you a young jack of diamonds or this could, my jacks can also be female a female okay um it's a blackish is a as a blackish with this person here i feel like this person is trying to portray like they friends like they like you as a friend but they like you more um than what they portray that they are and some and and this person is i feel like it's trying to be around you because of what you have he's similar or she's similar to your partner who you're dealing with now okay it's like the little brother of this person okay so let's see what is going on with my Capricorn? New relationship is coming here, Capricorn. Be careful, okay? We'll get more into that for the mid um, May read here. Be cautious of getting into partnership. There's a woman... Um, there's a woman that that I feel like is connected to your past here who is trying to do something who she has she she was doing some work on you or trying to do some work towards you here okay but she's not successful she and she's trying to to break that energy or whatever you got going on here um Capricorns a lot of financial abundance coming to you, but there is just interference with this legal. I feel like you guys have been trying to do something legally here with a male energy who is not no good. It was a snake. He was a snake that whole time. You guys, the, the whatever relationship you guys had with this individual here, it was all based on lies. It was never really, a, uh, this person was never really true. They weren't true of who they were. They were based on lies, based on manipulating. They were very calculated, okay? 
this is the, the you know that one song that comes in my head is that Kanye West song. Um, now I ain't saying she, I ain't saying she a gold digger, uh, but she ain't messing with no broke to broke. This is what that man is saying. Okay, he he one of those type of energies. Like he, you know, men can be gold diggers too. It's all and nowadays it's a lot of that out here. It's a lot of men will tell you they love you just so they can have a bed to sleep in at night. Cause they ass is too damn um whatever um weak. I feel like that's a weak ass uh, man, okay, who does that shit. Or whatever, but yeah, this is that that Kanye West song came in my head. Like they ain't messing around with nobody who got who ain't got no money. Who, who can't take care of their asses. Okay, women. A lot of inheritance is coming to my Capricorn. A lot of lump sums of money is coming to you. A lot of energy around that. But there is like something coming towards you of a change here. Okay? And this is that, that marriage. It's, it's going to end. It's going to end. But there is like a lot of jealousy around you from even this person's mistress. I feel like a lot of past energy. I got a lot of money coming in, Capricorn. God oh, damn. Y'all asses always be on y'all stuff. Yeah, y'all got some damn female energy around you. Okay, there's a woman who's going to also be tied to your new this new lover. There is a woman tied to this new lover here. His ex-wife or his baby the mother of his child that is very obsessed with him. Okay, like I said, we'll get more into um the mind of your um new relationship, past relationships more once we um get into that mid. Um, read here. Okay, Capricorn. What is going on with my Capricorn here? Mm. Yeah, that was that will be coming to an end. Unreliable, untrustworthy legal issues. Some of you guys will be moving or relocating or just coming out of something here. Uh, this person ain't gonna go so well though. There's a um there's some issues gonna be happening here. I feel like this is even even from the past here, Capricorn. I feel like you got separated from somebody. They did not take it so well here. And I feel like this whoever y'all currently is dealing with here is not gonna take it so well once it's all say, said and done here. There's a lot, a lot of happiness around y'all business here. But there's a lot of be cautious because there's extreme jealousy around you. And I do feel like this is coming from past. And I feel like whoever you guys are dealing with or was dealing with, they have a mistress or they had a mistress they have a woman that they're still sexually involved with here and don't y'all be sleeping around with no dirty zick or no dirty no dirty cool cat okay leave that person where it is at some of you guys are really tied up in a marriage type of energy here okay you guys have a lot of victory over some darkness that's around you here with a, a female and a, a younger male energy here these are family members here, you guys have a lot of victory here, but I do feel their energy searching for you and trying to figure out how to um, take back control of the situation what they had over you before when they was doing work on you. Okay, they're trying to interfere with a lot of you. Some of you guys, they are interfering with your life. Some of you guys are really are under attack. You guys been like that for a while, Capricorns. I always, if y'all go back to my videos uh, even from last year, you guys always have like really fucked up energy around you guys. Some of you guys were from other countries. Okay, I was I pick up I don't know I always pick up foreign shit when it comes to my Capricorns. Okay, um, yeah, some of you guys about to come into a new relationship, whether it's female or male. You guys remember it's all energy. If I'm saying masculine, you know you deal with women that are run. Okay. You got a new energy coming towards you guys. Somebody who is very a player type. Okay, who ain't just to settle down for you. Okay, what's coming towards you is a lot of jealousy. When it, a lot of legal shit going on. Somebody, this, whoever y'all dealing with is trying to stop y'all. Some of y'all going through some divorce stuff and they ain't trying to have that shit. Okay, they ain't trying to stop their money. I'm going to be honest with y'all. Some of y'all was taking care of a motherfucker. Whether it's female or whatever. And it's okay. I feel like it's more acceptable with a female, especially if she has children by you, for her to be like a stay-at-home mom. Or if that's what she chooses to do. Or for a man to take on that role to taking care of his female. But there's nothing wrong also with a female, a woman, having her own finances and doing her thing on the side also. But it's just really pitiful for a man to financially depend on a woman to take care of. And that is my opinion, okay? I do feel like that it needs to be balanced with the feminine and masculine 
masculine, okay? It's not saying that that I'm thinking of that old-fashioned way, but I just feel like it takes a lot of power from the man um, as um, the masculine on the 3D realm when he is financially dependent on a woman. It's very, to me, it is very weak, okay? And this man is that, okay? Y'all need to go and play that song, that Kanye West song. Some of you guys, some of you guys were like taking care of this um, person, okay? And if you did it, then you did it. I hope you guys are not continuing on that energy, okay? Just be careful in partnership. But I feel like a lot of you guys are trying to separate from someone, and they're not. They're not. They're not having it here. They're not really taking it so well. Let's see here. What is going on? Where's my Capricorn? What did my Capricorn need to know? Okay, you guys need to be alone. Some of you guys need to be alone, okay? If you got a family and everything, you guys take care of yourself. There is a, a um, there is some type of relationship coming in towards a lot of you guys that you guys will be really on cloud nine about here. Okay, like there's the, like a lot of happiness. It will be coming in towards you guys. Be careful of false um, commitments coming in because at this moment, I don't see that coming in within the next three months. I feel like this is somewhere near future here, maybe um, four to five months down the line here. That's going to be bringing you a lot of happiness here. There's a lot of uh, um, ancestor energy. They want you to be. They want you to be strong. Okay, there's a lot of power in you there's a lot of hard work you're putting into spiritually and um financially here abundantly here a lot of success coming in for you guys here a lot of endings a lot of death energy is coming in a lot of old um ways but you guys need to use your intuition here there's a lot of things coming to you guys through your dream times here okay that is um bringing you what is to come some of you guys have been cleansing cleansing away your ancestor bloodline as far as a lot of toxic shit that the the females went through or the males went through um a cycle okay a lot of you guys are ending those cycles here healing healing okay i feel like this is my high priestess this is the feminine energy who don't play she's like what okay like what okay you guys got a lot of brand new beginnings a lot of great news a lot of great energy some of you guys have been suffering in silence here um capricorns some of you guys have been in a lot of mental turmoil, okay? But that you guys will get the you guys will get the rewards of you having to endure that. But you you're enduring this for a reason. You're enduring it for a reason. Uh, it's not because you just they want the end of the spirits want you just to torture yourself, okay? It's not that, but there's a cycle you guys have been putting yourself through that um that was supposed to end years ago, but you stayed in it. So it's like you gotta you built up a lot of karmic um negative karma so you know you're going to come out of it but it's just a lesson you need to learn here there is a union coming here that the ancestors do not agree with there's a union you guys were dealing with before the ancestors never agree with here but you jumped into it because a lot of you guys want wanted love you wanted somebody to love you you wanted somebody to love you because you didn't love yourself okay New beginnings is coming. They want you to charge your head. You're about to be a free man, a free woman, walking away here. Grounding yourself, walking away out of this. This is a man walking away from a tombstone, but he has some graveyard dirt in his hand, okay? Because he has the key to all of this shit here, okay? But take care of some of you guys are really close, closing yourself off with spiritual, spiritually. And some of you guys have someone around you who wants revenge on you. Okay, a lot of burdens you guys have are on your shoulders here. Oh, y'all got some snakes around you guys, though, too. Um, Capricorns, I feel that. Okay, let's see what's going on with my Capricorns here. Yeah, a lot of endings are coming. It's coming, um, Aquarius. A lot of you guys have just been standing up for yourself, a lot of you guys have been protecting yourself here. Very successful business man or woman. Whatever you guys are trying to do, whatever you guys are touching here, it will turn to gold for you guys. Some of you guys are not seeing um, 
Some of you guys are not seeing things the way it, it needs to be. You guys go check out my Aquarius um, video and maybe some of my Capricorns. Y'all may have Aquarius and some of your um, parts of your strong parts in your chart. Okay, it's very similar. Very similar energy here. So you guys got some rose colored glasses on. Not seeing shit the way it needs to be or not wanting to see things. Okay, let's see here. Get some rest. Y'all drained. Y'all are drained. Some of y'all guys just sit up and think about this shit all day. But I, I do feel like there's some spiritual attacks here on the head um, energy here. And it's, it's lovers. It's, it's people. It's, it's, it's that past shit going on here. It's a female also involved in it. Somebody's just obsessed. There's obsessiveness going on here. You guys, get some rest. Even if you guys got to take like some melatonin or drink y'all some tea. If you don't like melatonin, drink y'all some like dandelion tea. I know a lot of people do that chamomile tea and shit. That shit don't work for me. My mind is too. It goes, goes, goes. There's always something to do. But I know like dandelion tea, roasted dandelion tea calms me down, calms my energy down here. Taking a hot bath, drinking my tea. Okay. And so, but you guys, you know, you're you're coming in out of the cold. There's a lot of uh, weight, but there is an ending coming to it, towards that. And you guys are fighting. Some of you guys are like, I feel. Look at this woman. She got this bandage around her head because she's tired. Like I said, I feel like a lot of mental, mental things is going on with um, some of you guys. Um, Whatever color, some of you guys wrap your head with a white, pure white scarf at night, okay? Or you wrap your head with the color that you resonate with more, okay? Because there's a lot of um, mental things going on with um, my Capricorns. Some of you guys are being spiritually attacked mentally here. So wrap your head with a white scarf around your head here to help... Um, filter out a lot of that have protect your head here okay if you guys got my uh, fuck off back wash pour a little bit of that on your crown area to help cleanse that and wrap your head with a white scarf or whatever color you are drawn to like one of your favorite colors okay where there's pink red whatever uh, wrap it let it be a pure color of that here you know I am, and I am um, about to put, put my um, my I have created a mental cleansing bath wash here that helps bring your back your your mental state into balance it help filter out a lot of things it's like a healing bath wash here okay and i will be posting putting that up and i will be posting it in my instagram y'all so go check out my instagram okay i will be posting a lot more there um here in a few i just have to take a break from that shit for a minute y'all because i got this shit to do okay all right but um you guys yeah so i don't know who that's for okay Okay, you guys got the world in your head, but you guys like your y'all relationships, a lot of devil with y'all feel like y'all got devil energy just around y'all. Dealing with devilish energy here, okay? Save your money. I kid y'all not. Aquarius, a lot of y'all enter I me. Mean, I said Aquarius. Capricorns, maybe y'all dealing with the Aquarius. Y'all y'all have it in y'all chart. Okay, y'all need to go check out that reading here. There will be people coming in offering you new love here. There is uh, masculine, feminine energy around you. Kind of been watching you, want to get into your attention here. I want to get your attention here. I don't really feel like y'all paying attention to that shit though, Aquarius, okay? There's a lot of happiness and celebration coming in towards you here. A lot of victory. You guys will reap, um, you know, great things that's coming to you guys. Don't look back. Keep going, um, um, Capricorns. Okay, there is a twin flame, or um, I hate to say twin flame, this is my cards usually be saying though, but the, uh, there's a very soul tie energy coming in towards you because you know I don't like that twin flame shit. Okay, the way they describe twin flame is a totally different way than what it really is. Okay, but um, there's a very soul tie energy coming in. Okay, you remember, we guys we don't only have one soulmate, there was lots of soulmates that we have. So, you guys, um, look, y'all don't got shit. Don't forget who you are, Capricorn. You are, whether you're male or female, you are the high priestess. You are the magician. You are the wise one, okay? Stay focused on your business, man. Y'all supposed to be making some money, y'all. 
whatever y'all trying to do with y'all business. And I feel like a lot of this is entrepreneurship for a lot of my Capricorns. Y'all going to be on y'all shit. Y'all going to be on y'all shit. Making a lot of clientele coming through. Just really being fruitful here. Okay? A lot of great energy coming in for you um, Cap, um, Capricorns. I keep on saying Aquarius. Yeah. I should have told Aquarius uh, that too. They need to cover their head. But I forgot all about that. Um, I've been getting that. A lot of my, even my clients been contacting me. And I have more than just one of them contacting me. Said they were having a lot of spiritual attacks over their head. So, um, yeah, I'm trying to see what healing cards I'm about to get for you guys. Um, let me see if I can even got this book. Oh, there it is. I'm all in the day on camera. Sorry, y'all. <laughs> all right, let me see. I usually pull these out at the end of the month, but I've been told to give you guys this Capricorn, this angel. And I have to read from this because I don't usually don't play with these cards at all, really. But I love them. Okay, what message do you have for my Capricorns? What message do you have for my Capricorns? Ooh, lady. Enjoy growth and reap rewards here. Look at this. This is a beautiful uh, picture of this lady here. Let's see if I can find the damn thing. So I can read it. Okay. Reap what you have sown and enjoy the fruits of your labor. What did I say? You guys will reap what you have given out. And a lot of you guys, will, like I said before, will stand in a cycle over and over again. And that's why I do the readings that I do. Okay? Because a lot of people need to come out of cycles, toxic ass shit. Everybody ain't going through flowers and butterflies, you guys. Okay? But a lot of you guys need to come out of a lot of things, and I'm here to give you that message, okay? So, you guys, this, that's why a lot of this shit is going on with you guys, but there will be beauty after the rain. Grow and expand in all areas of your life. Fertility, growth, and abundance are all important <clears throat> with, when the lady arrives in your life. All the seeds you have planted are coming to life, and there are plenty more rewards to come in a material sense. So you guys, like I said, man, yeah, y'all just to be balling out here. <laughs> I'm a Capricorn. No, I'm just kidding. But a lot of y'all just to be. Oof. All the seeds you have planted are coming to life. There are plenty more rewards to come in a material sense. This card can represent financial security and comfort. It shows that there will be more than enough to go around. If you are making business deals or set, setting intentions to create financial growth, this card indicates a considerable amount of monetary success. Damn. And that's why whoever y'all dealing with don't want to leave y'all asses. Because why you want to brush it with no broke, but broke nigga? Ah! Some of y'all, I'm telling y'all, was a man. Some of y'all was dealing with a man who, who was financially draining y'all asses. And they get that. They know what they're doing. And whoever they're dealing with now, they're trying to, they don't care about that person. they only dealing with that person because they got something. But they don't got, they're not as a bount, bountiful as you are. You are money magnet. Okay? Capricorns, Tauruses, Virgos, the earth energy, that's what we about. We attract money. Some of you guys got some good placements in your second house. Okay? Some of you guys got some, y'all, just what you are. You, you attract money, and this person knows that. And that's, they was a living that high life. They were living that high life, but not no more. Okay? And this person will reap that karma. And they, they are getting that karma. They're not trying to. They're not trying to reap their karma at all. They're trying to fight that shit to the depth of it. Okay? But they, they won't have no victory over it. Okay, Capricorns? Okay, Capricorns, I'm trying to make sure there's nothing else to um, be said. But please like, share, and subscribe, you guys. If you like a personal reading or any information about my protection services or items, you guys hit me up at evolvingwisdom5.com. Check me out on my Instagram, okay? If you guys would like to donate, please hit that. Um, go into the description box or you can get to the information that is pinned at the bottom. Again, you guys, this is Evolving Wisdom. And yes, I'm here. And I'm still evolving.